Good evening, gentle bodies, and welcome to Let's Play Monarchemia Alchemist of Alravis. Oh, I love this game. I love that intro. I love everything about this game. Mm. In case any of you were wondering, it, it, it didn't really end up winning the vote, but there were so few votes, I just pretty much flipped the coin on the matter. Seriously, what's wrong with you guys? It's called a vote for a reason. You must be the guys that sit home when the election happens and then complain the president that you didn't want gets in office. But anyway, enough about politics. I'm going to tell you a little bit about this game because I love it so much. Um, it's actually a spin-off of a much older series that I actually might do afterwards. I don't know when I'll do that, but Artillier Iris, if you don't know what that is, uh, this is a much later spin-off that really just wasn't that popular, and I don't know why, honestly. I'm going to switch that to that. Um, I'm going to leave it on English because anyone that plays it in Japanese is, well, obviously too weebu for me. Anyway, um... A lot is going to start kind of slow, because, you know, it's a Japanese RPG. Uh, but I love the combat in this game. I like the story, okay? It's pretty cool. I, I love a lot of the characters. You'll just... I, I, I don't know. Well, I guess we'll see. But it's time to go to school. Great. Who are you? Well, I am... Oh, okay, Sulfur, are you all alone too? That's a pretty f messed up game for a cat. I should I should get a fucking cat and name him Volcanic Ash. See. Can I stay with you? Hmm. Lonely kid. Thank you. Um, I'm Vane. Our main character. Vane. Is my name. Oh yeah. You can tell he's gonna be like <laughs> all the bitches are gonna be scratching at his door. Hmm. Oh Vane, give me a penis, please. So um, yeah, this is uh, this is pretty much a taste of what the graphics gonna be like on the overworld and whatnot. You know. This is Al Rivas Academy, yeah. the place where they teach alchemy. Indeed it is! We have come here to learn the alchemic arts! Which is apparently the same as magical arts and wizardry. So, 
I'm totally cool with that. Who are you? And why are you in the forest all alone? Oh god, where's the body? Where did you dump the kids? Don't lie to me! <laughs> Sorry if that gets annoying, by the way. I, I try not to make it make too much noise. Look at the pretty flowers. He, he looks really oh, poor. I Look at him. Found you. Can we talk for a okay, I finally found you, poor kid. I'm glad you came out here. I have candy, but it's in my pants. You'll have to unzip it. Who are you? Hmm. Is this your mana? Mana? Hmm. Mana? So far is yeah, my friend. Yeah, he's just my kitty cat, buddy. You know, I feed him milk and play with him with yarn and stuff. Uh. Please don't stare at me with those terrified eyes. <laughs> Please don't stare at me with those terrified eyes. I, they bring back, well, slightly pleasant memories, but at the same time, I, I don't wish to think about them right now. Do you, I mean, you two live here alone? Well, it's kind of overgrown with vines, so either we do or we live here with, uh, Poison Ivy. When we go into town, everyone is frightened. Yep. I would assume so. People around here probably have no knowledge of alchemy. Fucking rednecks. Your powers may seem inexplicable to them. Well, that's their fault for being uh, ignorant, then, isn't it? Oh, you don't know about alchemy either? Of course not. Who would? <laughs> Why would he? I mean, unless he's just he used to mixing shit together. Alchemist. Not too long ago. Really? So what, you just moved in here, Vane, and didn't know shit? Yeah. Yep, he loves him, so no one really liked him either. Oh, Silver, I can tell already we're gonna be friends. I see. Your assholery level is right up there with mine. Do you know anything about this place? Mmm, well, it has a roof, and it keeps the bugs out of my face during the night for the most part. I can't remember much. For the most part. Only vague images. Hmm, yeah. I see. No wonder finding you was so difficult. <laughs> well, then why do you keep stalking me, old gold guy? Why? What is he doing here, anyway? Um, why are you here? Apparently, Sulphur is a huge super manly voice, so. That's what Sulphur wants to know. Hmm. Oh, my, excuse me, I completely forgot. My name is Zeppel Creeper. Zeppel Creeper. That is one kick ass name if I ever heard one. Like, I'm not very good with names, but, I mean. If you're gonna be an alchemy instructor, I would want to be alchemy named Apple Creeper. Academy. Yes, of course. It's a school for young alchemists from all over the world. Oh, Zeppel. See, I came here today to invite you to the academy. Oh, did you now? Me? Well, that's good to know, Zeppel, because we get to go to school. God damn it! <laughs> Actually, this game kind of reminds me of a. Uh, fusion of Persona and uh, an Atelier game. You'll see what I mean later on. But, uh, yeah. Basically, the guy comes in the middle of the woods, finds some poor kid, like, locked up in an old cabin, and is all like, You're going to school! I guess he's one of those officers. I know it's in Japanese, but it's still awesome. The songs, that is. I don't know what they mean, but they make me want to dance. Tell me that shit don't make you want to dance. Uh. Oh, God. I should actually probably mention that, uh, the intro that you guys saw. That was actually a pretty, pretty solid demonstration of a lot of the characters' powers. You'll see. You'll see later on. Like, I mean, not all of them were allies, but still, it was pretty sweet. It was pretty sweet, not gonna lie. Jeez, what's with all the fucking milfs in this place? Jeez, Vane, where'd you learn that word? Oh, I learned it from Zeppel. He talked to me in the, in the truck on the way here. Oh, Zeppel. You are such a player. <laughs> the cat's fucking bored. 
Well, I'm sure you're all bored of me by now, so yep, yep, you just got here, Principal, and I already hate your guts. I hope I never have to see you again. Lastly, once again, congratulations on your enrollment to this school. Well, yay, glad we're, we paid money to be here. Orientation is over. Students will return to their classrooms now. If you don't know why I'm using that voice, you'll see why. <laughs> she has always got to be the one person that's Russian and it's just an asshole to everybody. And Rage just, he's thinking, he's thinking super hard. Hey, you're the way, move it, girl! He's like, whoa! I'm standing literally in one block of space in front of you. Why don't you just go around me? What a bitch. What a bitch. <laughs> Did I already say I was gonna love you, Sulphur? Because I am. I wanna hug that fucking cat. Uh. Of course you were, Vane. You're. God, you're such a little. Mm. I just wanna smack him in the face. What? I, I haven't played it in a long time, but I remember some of the things. Well, hello and welcome. It's been a month now. About a month now. Wow, Christ. Oh, it's nice to see you again, Mr. Zeppel. So you dressed him up to look fat fancy in about a month. That's about all you did. Yes, it, is. it sure is. Oh, and by the way, I'll be your homeroom teacher. So you must show your respect by calling me Professor Zeppel. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to shut up, for God's sake, Vane, I was fucking kidding. Now, let's go to class. Do you know where it is? I have no idea. God, son of a... This is going to be a long time, Vane. It's going to be a lot of spankings in order, but I'll get you there. Then we'll go together. Don't want to get lost on your first day now. Okay. Seriously, Sulphur has, like, all of the personality. He's great. I love that cat. He's so cool. Uh, you'll see why I love him so much later. Chapter 1. A cat, a boy, and alchemy. That's a pretty honest title. My name is and we hear his voice. It's nice to meet you all. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too. Why are we forced to say this, uh, teacher? God, uh, it can be difficult at times, so please come talk to me if you need help. Of course, of course. If I'm not too busy, I'll be happy to discuss anything with you. I, <laughs> if I'm not busy banging bitches or whatever, I'll happy. Zeppel is such a pimp. You know he is. Just look at that guy. Now, <laughs> you're all tired, so today's intro will be quick and simple. Oh, really? And here comes the tutorials. That's it oh, today. wait, no, not now. Start tomorrow, so don't be late. The orientation is basically this is how you're gonna live for the next four years of your life. Good luck. Everybody's just like, oh god, why did I come here? Oh, what are you upset about? What's wrong? You don't really. Can I ask you something? Hey, a lady's talking to you. If you're already worried about it, your future. <laughs> Silver's like, dude, if you're already thinking about uh, what's going to happen if you fail, then you're going to fucking fail. Well, I mean, come on, Silver, don't be an asshole about it. It's like, no, I am going to be an asshole about it because you're a fucking wimp. <laughs> and then they just start arguing with each other. Look, there's a lady talking to you for crying out loud. I'm sorry. I was just feeling a little faint at heart is all. Yeah, like you always are. And Sulphur's there to smack you upside your stupid face. What? Hmm? Uh, you finally noticed. Jeez, it's not nice to ignore people. Indeed it is not, pink-haired lady. Gee, I wonder if you're going to be our healing mage. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry about the spoiler. <laughs> no, really. Um, Who were you talking to? Huh? Oh, Sulphur. Oh, so you were talking to a cat. That's cool. That's cool. I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> he can talk and he just says, Meow. What? Yeah, meow. Oh, how cute. Is he your mana? Yes, he is. How unusual. Well, he can speak. He just doesn't talk to anyone but Vane. 
So I assume he's just too good for you. Really? Mm -hmm. Not like I've met a lot of mana either. This one's mine. Okay, so she has a mana too. Let's see more about mana. It's a little fairy. Hello, well. Jess. What's going on? Well, that's uh. <laughs> Uh, I love the designs for some of these mana. They really look creative to me. Mm. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just a wind spirit right there. I want to introduce you. Come on, say hello. Say hello. Oh hi! Nice to meet you. Uh, well, uh, you look pretty. I, I don't know. Just, damn it, Vane! Why are you so? Oh, uh, nice to meet you too. I just imagine Vane's tongue is like. Okay. Ten foot long, and he just can't talk without it falling out of his face and onto his shoes. Don't worry, man of wind. I'm sure we'll talk to you more later. Not enough, but more later. See? She talks normally. <laughs> She's like, "Hey, on, I just want to show you this." All right, that's enough. Get out of here. Yeah, I guess you're right. Oh, but I'm really glad. You were mumbling to yourself for a while. Oh, is that so? I was worried the guy sitting next to me was crazy. Uh, not gonna make a comment on that. <laughs> My name's Jess. 